Hey guys, so we are in Sam's Club and we're at the Tinley Park location. I haven't been to a Sam's Club in probably 20 years and I want to take you guys along and kind of do an in-store shop. I have a few things that I'm looking for, mostly the Fair Life Protein, but you guys always ask to do a Sam's Club shop. So I thought instead of sharing, I've just shared my Costco one, but um, so I don't need to buy a lot, but I wanted to share with you some things. So I got a couple of the kids with me, Leo's with me, and I figured we could do a shop together. So hopefully you guys enjoy and give you a thumbs up. This is really nice. I actually need a new desktop. Um, this one's $8.79. i5. Um, I want an Apple though. An Apple desktop because I want to get um, Final Cut Pro. But these are really sharp. Look at these, Sophie. These are nice, huh? I should buy you this, huh? You should let me know. They have... What is this? Power. Oh, I actually could use that. Oh, this is like a USB and everything, premium cables. I have a lot of, oh, look at these double chargers, guys. We go through chargers like you wouldn't believe in my house. It's ridiculous. Power bank. And they have the flat chargers too. They have, this is actually pretty nice. So, a lot of TVs. Oh, 14, huh? A lot of electronics. Let's see. Only got one. Oh, Samsung front load dryer, five ninety nine, and washer five ninety nine. That's a pretty good deal. That's actually a couple hundred dollars cheaper than Costco, so that's pretty good. Oh, these are cool. Watch it, guys. Let me see. You should get one. Oh, and it charges your phone and everything, huh? That's cool. That one's 20. Look at 75 inch TV, 750. You don't need a 75 inch TV. Let's see. A home theater for 200. These are pretty good deals, I guess. Oh, this is, look at this. I want to show this to Leo. 130. A sound bar. Vizio. That's pretty nice. I wanted to get one of those for Leo for the basement. So. I don't know if these are an Apple distributor like Costco is. They have a lot of laptops and stuff, but I don't think they're an Apple distributor. So they have like, this one's pretty good. An HP Full HD and i5 for $4.99. I used to have actually a very similar laptop to this. It's not too bad. There's a Fitbit. Oh, Fitbits. I have an Apple Watch. I don't know which one's superior, but this is a uh, Fitbit Versa 3 for 160. That's pretty good. And Fitbit Lux for 120. If you guys have Fitbits, do you or in that? Oh my gosh, my mom. If you guys had a Fitbit and uh, or a Apple Watch, let us know down below which one you think is superior. These are way cheaper though. You know Apple, they they charge pretty penny. Routers, smart light bulbs. You guys don't need, these kids are ridiculous. Oh, they got Google. They got the Google stuff. All right, look at these. This is a faux tree, a hundred bucks, but she's pretty. And then, oh, I'm sorry, you guys get mad when I say she, so. Uh, well, anyway, that's a big tree for 100 and then they have these little ones for 80 But they are faux. They're pretty, though. So they have these hotel sheet sets for 100 a 700 thread count for King. Oh, they do have this for 59 So they have the, I think it's the Cole, Cole, what is it called? Comer? Cole, Cole, Kohler brand at Costco for 100 and this is just whatever that brand is for 60 for these garbage cans of stainless steel. So that's actually a pretty good deal. That's coming in cheaper. So what else they got? Let's see. We have gaming chairs. This one is 170. Not bad. These kids are driving me absolutely insane. Just so you guys know. You guys are wondering. These two. They have to look at <laughs> guys put it away. I will say their appliances are priced very nicely. 
So that Samsung microwave is 305, that stove is a thousand, and that refrigerator is 1800. Very nicely priced. I will I will say that. Very nice. I do like the, the pricing on this stuff. All right, so they have all their summer stuff. This is actually a pretty good price. Look at all these floats and stuff. They're only 20 bucks. And they have these ones. Oh, look at the monkey. These are really cute. $20. An animal ring float. We haven't been swimming yet. A splash pad. This one's cute. I love splash pads and all that stuff. This one's 25 That's pretty cool. Look at this. This is 90 Water slide. It's, this is what it's called if you guys were looking. Inflatable pool slide. This is cool. And they have a water basketball hoop. They have a lot of nice outdoor like summer stuff. This is pretty cool. We should tell your grandma to get one. Oh, these are for like the, when you go on the water. Yeah. Like into the big. I think this is, that one's 250 It's pretty sharp though. I will say I agree with Leo. They do have a really nice junk food selection. What is this? Chicken and waffles, chicken chips. What the hell? What does that mean? Let's see. 24 chips, 9 carbs. For 24 of them. You want to try chicken chicken breast chips? Look what they look like. That's kind of weird. Stacy pita chips. Can you not get those? No, I'm not getting those because you guys just ate them all. Max pork skins. We should get these. Oh my goodness. And then they have fried pork rinds here. Their their snack selection is pretty pretty legit. I will say that they have a nice. This is like where people with vending machines probably come. You know what I mean? <laughs> Their snack section is really nicely. Yeah. They have a really nice. Oh man. Mm. Yeah, they have a food court. You're not getting that. Oh my goodness. Yeah, All right, guys. So they have sugar-free uh, Tarani, which is nice. Five forty-eight. So they have sugar-free hazelnut, sugar-free vanilla, and sugar-free caramel. I think I might get some sugar-free vanilla. I could find it because that's a really good deal and I like the Tarani ones a lot so if I can find it I will definitely pick it up but they have 548 I think it's pretty good all right so they do have bangs here for $33.98 for a case and it's a variety which is nice they have a nice variety um, they have the monster energy that's 35 as well and then they have the Alani new which I thought was really great they don't have this at Costco um, 35 so if you guys like the Alani new they aren't too bad Nice selection of energy drinks. Monsters, they have the low carb energy monster, that's 35 as well. They have this, this black stag espresso with cream for 17. So here are the girls dresses. Girls dresses are pretty decently priced. Are these just one, one dress for 10 bucks? And then they have like a two pack for 15, which is pretty good. And they're pretty too. Oh, look at here. These ones are instant markdown for $7.98. These are really cute. Maybe I'll get one for Becky. These are really pretty. 6X. Let me see if they have it in her. No, they don't. But if you have like a 4 or 5, it's a good price. Probably why they're marked down because they have limited sizing. Becky's like a 10. Some of these are a little too babyish for her. She won't like them. But... These are the women's dresses. These are 20 ones are pretty for 20. I'm trying to think what else? They got some sandals here. I used to always put my kids in these sandals when they were little to cover up their toes. Let's see. Adidas Superstar sneakers for 60. Oh, these are cute. These are sharp. Get some fat laces. I used to rock these back in the day. So 60 bucks, that's a good deal. If you guys were shopping around. They got the Toms here for 30. Okay, okay. I see. So we're in the frozen section now. I am looking for what is that all members mark? I'm looking for the Tyson grilled chicken strips or whatever, the blackened chicken strips that everybody's talked about for like the last like six years that I don't find in my area. And I still don't think we have them here, but 
we're looking. Oh, luckily, chicken wings, 10 pounds for $34.98. It's not that great of you. I mean, that's about what they cost now. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see. We got some water. They have a core for $13.98. Oh, they have their own Sam's Club Pure Alkaline for $9.78. That's actually 50 cents cheaper than Costco. Now, this looks good. Breakfast bowls, dirty rice with eggs, cheese, and sausage for 15 bucks. Oh, I bet those Yeah, I love dirty rice. New York style cheesecake for $12.68. Members mark ice cream 1068. How much are the shrimps here? Eight dollars a pound. That's pretty good. Okay. Hmm, maybe we'll get some. They have a very nice selection of like shrimps and like seafood. A lot of cooked shrimp though. Oh, look at here. It's 95. Okay, Costco was actually cheaper because it was 10 pounds. The 10 pound box, and I want to say it was one. A little bit over a hundred bucks. The big 10 pound box at Orland. So. It's not even the same crap. Oh, no, no. Lobster tail, 136, five pound box. I don't know who needs five pounds. Ooh, look at the seafood medley right here. Mussels, everything. 1358, three pounds. That's pretty good. Yeah. Have you guys never had this? So it's mussels. I don't know. It's Remy, a squid, shrimp, and octopus. And you just kind of throw it all in the pot. It's really good. I've made them before. And they have all types of Italian sausages and stuff like that. That'd be nice. For like barbecues and stuff, that's a good option. Got bacon, $16.98. That's about four bucks cheaper than Costco. Oh, uh, they have the already cooked bacon here. I know a lot of people like that. Jimmy Dean pork sausage. $7.98 the silk unsweetened almond milk, a couple dollars cheaper than Costco. Ooh, strawberry lemonade, $4.48. Chobani flips, $12.98. Hmm. Look at the Lunchables, $7.98. Alright, this is a good deal. This is the Asian Chop Salad Kit. $268, and they have a Southwest Chop Salad for $258. I think I might actually get this for lots. Oh, pretty wimpy bag, but Rhea likes that one. Oh, this is the one, $268. They're very small. I guess they're about the same as Costco, because Costco's is a double pack with six. So it's about the same. Yeah. Caesar Salad Kit. That one's $418. What is this one? Watermelon Crunch. That's kind of weird. I can't get down with some of the weird stuff. I've never seen these before. These are chili relleno chicken sausages. So, 150 per link, 10 fat, one carb, 14 protein. 9.98. It actually tastes pretty good. They probably have a nice little kick. Rosa poblano peppers and cotilla cheese with mild heat. They sound pretty good. And they got Cajun and Dewey sausages for 15.48. I will say they play music really loud. I hope I don't get demonetized. <laughs> These are $14.98 chicken sausages. Honey, habanero, Monterey and Jack cheese, mozzarella and roasted garlic, gouda and pear. So those are an option. The big scallop potatoes are $7.38. They're way cheaper at Costco. These are about a dollar cheaper at Costco. These are the Panera mac and cheeses. I don't buy them from the kids anymore because they're like 900 calories of one, so I stopped buying it for them. But they eat them all one day. Yeah, they love them. So, Leo said that their meat prices are about the same, but here's a fun fact, guys. If there's a Costco and a Sam's Club within a few miles, what's a mile difference, like 10 miles? Huh? With the Costco and the Sam's, if they're how many miles? They usually are pretty close in price, right? Yeah. It's like if, if within... They're, if they're within they're, if, I don't know what the exact distance is, but they're within a certain distance yeah. of each other. But, but ooh, they have a nice sushi selection. I love sushi. Wow, these look good. This isn't real sushi. It's real sushi for me. I know this isn't real sushi, guys. I know you guys are like, ew, that's gross, but I like it. But I can't have any right now. Ooh, cucumber avocado roll. Mm, California rolls are my, especially with the crunchy ones. Yum. So good. $7.50. That's actually a really good deal. <sighs> I can't have that right now, but it's so good. Imitation crab. I'm not a fan. It's not carbs in it. It's good, though. Mm, it's alright. It's 
Oh god, I'd rather eat dog poop. It's so gross. Always trying to expand his collection of booze bottles. We have so much unopened booze in the basement, it's ridiculous. Alright guys, so if you're looking for parties, these are pretty cool. I mean, 21 and over obviously, but like jello shots. I think this is $17.98, that's a good deal. Um, stuff to make margaritas, I think this is 30. What is that? Party hard? I don't know what that means. It's like 40, I think it's 40 little miniature shots in here. Oh, that sounds like a bad idea. Ugh. Oh, it's here's... A deal, but it's a bad idea. <laughs> Malibu with pineapple juice and coconut rum. Ooh, $21. I love that. That's like a drink I can have. Oh, that's that. I don't drink that stuff, but that looks like a really bad idea. <gasps> what are these? Old Smoky Moonshine Pickles. That sounds like a really bad idea as well. Always trying to expand his collection of booze bottles. We have so much unopened booze in the basement, it's ridiculous. This is worth sharing. This is $60. This is, I don't know what the name of this brand is, Tramatontino. All in one ceramic pan. This is like that expensive, like $300 pan that everybody's like sharing online. Um, and this, but it comes with the pan, the lid, like a steamer, and the spoon. 60 bucks. I think this is a way better deal. And it's literally that same pan. I forget the name of the pan that, you know what I'm talking about that everybody's showing? Oh, you wouldn't notice. Ooh, this is a good deal. 10 piece mixing bowl set for $20. And it comes with, with the lids. That's a good deal. I, I don't know if Rhea was here. She'd be like, mom, get it. Ooh, wheat straw dinnerware. I like the color of this. Oh, it's plastic. Wow, that's nice. For like outside, outside eating. So we grab the cart. Um, we got little bottles here for 20. Strainer for 25. It's a nice strainer. It's too big for my sink, but it's nice. Oh, Rhea's favorite. The Brita, $42.98. Way cheaper, or way cheaper at Costco. Oh, look at Lee. A drink cooler set for 20. And you put your bottles and your beers. It's a pretty good deal. 20 bucks. Oh, we got little water things for 30. Oh, this is cute. Two tier basket. This would be nice for ours for this countertop. Yeah. Oh, the ninja. We paid 100 at Walmart though, no? We paid 150 for ours too, but it was like a Black Friday thing, I think. Yeah. It was like so. a real big sale. Remember, we went to like three different ones to find it. Oh, shaped ice maker and ice cream maker. 30 bucks from Dash. Pretty good. Oh, they have a variety of the KitchenAid mixers too for about 380. You guys were looking. You know, Rhea would have loved all the kitchen appliances. Oh, here's a cereal keeper you were talking about. They got the iRobot Roomba from 230. Vacuums, let's see, anything good. Shark Plus 160. It's like not a cordless one though, so I don't know if that's a deal breaker for some of you guys. Uh oh, she's calling. Oh, a stand up freezer for 300. That's pretty good. And they have a chest freezer for 250. This is the way to go. Yeah. Those chest freezers. Yeah, things get buried at the bottom, guys. Definitely, if you're going to get a freezer, get a stand up one. Because the bottom ones. I'm speaking I from mean, experience. You're have access to like to, and, yeah. Yeah, yeah, for sure. But this is a good deal. Sophia, grab the cart. Ooh, we need a new throw. How much are these? 20 bucks. Dang. I don't know. I can't justify it. Oh, this is cool. Kids Explorer sofa. That's cool. 190. I mean, that's a lot of money. But it's still cool. Okay, Becky, come on. And they have kids bedding for 25 for twin beds. Like That's that not bad. One. I like that one. All right. Um, Twix shakers? I don't even know what. 15. Man, I wonder what I could put this on. This is great for ice cream, cookies, milkshakes, and more. Holy cow, what can I put this on? I kind of want that. You guys know I also love the seasoning oil, so... And they have Nashville style hot chicken seasoning blend. I mean, I might get that. I love seasoning. They have nice seasoning aisle. 
Dang, I don't know if I should get that or not. Dang. Friday? What is this? Fry seasoning? Oh my god. Got that. Nicole has that. That's where she gets it from. Holy cow. Let's add those seasonings to the list there. I have a problem when it comes to seasoning. Oh man, they got nothing but Kinders here. Wait till Leo sees this. Lemon pepper. Kinders buffalo. Holy cow. Very nice. Butcher. This is really fajita seasoning. What the heck? Oh man, I need one of everything. Um, just want to let you guys know if you're looking for formula, they have the Similex Total Care here. And this is the um, Sam's Club in Tinley. So if you guys are looking for formula, they do have it. Did you check the seasonings? I got some seasonings in the cart. Don't look. Oh, what is this? Oh, look, they have baby lotion, baby wash. That's kind of nice. Oh, here's some more. Gentle Pro from Gerber. They have some in here as well. So if you guys were looking for your babes, I got you. All right, so protein, they have the core power, 42 grams for 22.98. I don't need that much power, uh, protein. <laughs> um, they have Atkins for 18.98, Boost. I'm, I'm kind of disappointed because I came here specifically for that. Slim Fast. Oh, they have the thick crunch bars. Those are really good. I think I might just get some Premier Protein and just do that. I don't know if I want chocolate peanut butter. Yeah, I don't think I like any of these. I might just go to Costco and get the ones I like. They have the chocolate peanut butter, chocolate, and vanilla. And that's not, they're 24.16, which is, I think Costco's 20, so about the same. All right, I do want to let you guys know they have the built bars here. So they're 21, 12 for, I don't know how many are in here. Let's say 12 bars. So and it's the cookies and cream, salted caramel, and coconut puff. So if you guys wanted to buy them here, that's an option. I haven't seen these sold in stores. So there you guys go, built bars. 21, 12 for a case of 12. That makes them about 43 cents a bar. All right, my friends, and we are back. This is gonna be like a super small haul, but I wanted to share with you guys about a hundred bucks. Well, I guess not small in price, but these are some few things that I wanted to share with you. So I ended up picking up these um, mini squares. So they had the big ones and then they had the mini ones. So um, I have a Rice Krispie when I'm working out, like right when I get to the gym, so I could have two of these. And I think these were eight bucks, so 52 of them, not bad. Pick those up and they're patriotic. And then I found this, and I this was a really good little treat snack here. These are the sugar-free Jello pudding and Jello cups. So these were 1048, and there's 24 of them. And like I said, sugar-free, and it comes with the pudding and the Jello. So really nice deal. I also picked up these fruity pebbles for the kids because they've been asking for fruity pebbles. And this was 6.48, so that was a really good deal. So I picked that up. I got a thing of asparagus just to cook up for prep for me. And I believe these were seven dollars. So I picked that up. I got these petite dill pickles. I love pickles. These are 3.48 and just for me to snack on is one of the snacks I can have throughout the day. So I picked those up seasonings y'all already know so i got the friday uh french fry seasoning my friend nicole has this and i was like dang i've been wanting to try it so i picked this up i believe this was like four or five dollars so i picked that up and then for some chicken i got the nashville style hot chicken and we have some chicken wings so i figured we can throw that on there and i have some chicken for myself so i figured that would be really good with some dip so i picked that up and then they had a ton of this Kinder's brand stuff. And this is the fajita blend. And I figure I can cut up some of the meat that I have from Costco and season it with this. I will say I really do enjoy their seasoning section <coughs> over the section at Costco. But honestly, that's, I'll, I'll talk, to, I'll give you guys my honest opinion. So um, I got some raspberries. These were two forty eight dollars because I have berries every day. I just wanted to switch it up. I got the sugar-free classic hazelnut uh, syrup from Tarani. This was $5.48. I thought that was a pretty good deal. So I picked that up. I think the kids are throwing out the freaking forks. I mean, they're like, this was $8 and I just picked them up because we don't have any forks. I got a thing of grapes for the girls to snack on. If you have dogs, be very careful. Um, redless, red skinless seedless or red seedless grapes. I think these are six bucks. So picked that up. 
And then the girls are gonna do a pool day. So I wanted to have some chips for them to bring to the pool. I got some Cheetos, some Flamin' Hot Cheetos and some Sun Chips. They were $4.48 each, which I thought was a pretty good deal. So they're like the family size. And then I got this bag of shrimp. I believe this is $17 and I'm just gonna to have throughout the week. All right, so I wanna give you guys my honest thought. Am I gonna convert over to Sam's Club? No. I, I'm, I'm this, this is just, maybe it's the locations in our area, but I'm just gonna be honest with you, I don't find them to be clean. I don't, I mean, I'm not trying to, they're not nearly as, the bathrooms were atrocious. They were like carnival bathroom. Um, and I just felt like it wasn't as clean as Costco is. Costco I feel like is really clean um and very neatly organized i i strive off of that i think that looks really i if i'm gonna buy groceries you know and i'm gonna bring stuff into my home i want it to come from like a clean place so that was one as price point as far as meat they're about the same i just think that costco has a better selection and better choices um better quality um i do think that they're like for parties for as far as like liquor and stuff like that and like beer i would go to sam's club i think they're better priced as opposed to costco i think they have a nicer selection and i think their seasonings their seasoning aisle was really good i really do like that so i like seasoning so that's a that's kind of a thing for me so i think that's a really um good idea and i think like their snacks i think their snack aisle is really good especially because i have kids and it's summer and we do pool days and you know people over i think they have a really nice selection as far as that but for like the nitty-gritty of stuff i feel like costco has a better selection and is better priced on some items um and i think their coupon book is better than i don't know if sam's has a coupon book i know they have like instant in-store coupons but coupon book at costco i think is way better um like for example like their fabric freshener pearls for like laundry are on sale i think for 10 or 12 bucks and they're 19 dollars on sale at sam's so stuff like that where you know where it would add up i prefer to just buy it at costco so that is my honest opinion i wanted to go and like do and like give it a fear shot i really went for the fear life protein because i wanted it and our sam's club was the only place having it right now and they didn't even have it so that was basically the reason why we did that but if like i said you know it's up to you what's ever in your area and stuff like that but it definitely was like a wholesale walmart which obviously sam's club is like a bigger thing of walmart um just for preference price point and quality i just prefer costco what can i say well, who do you guys prefer i would like to know i know some places i know people like in arkansas they, they only have sam's club there because it's like the home of walmart but if you guys uh what are your what are your thoughts what do you think Maybe I'm just a snob. I don't know, but you know, I'm going to start a war, right? I'm showing my colors. I'm representing my set Costco for life, but these are just honest thoughts. And I wanted to give it a fair shot. Like I said, um, for Leo's mom's party, I probably will go back to Sam's club just for like chips, beer, um, stuff like that. Uh, just because it's, you know, the price point is nice and they have a really nice selection, but as far as everything else, I gotta go with Costco, Costco till I die. But all right, guys, I'll see you on the next one. Bye, friends.